Good morning. morning. Here we are at the Elk Devils Trailhead. This is also the uh, trailhead that you use to climb South Sister, which is up there in the background. You see it up there? We're not going there today, but we were going to take the uh, Elk Devils Trail up to the Moraine Lake Trail and make a loop out of this. It goes around a butte. I think it's about a six mile loop. So, we haven't been on this before. The mosquitoes are out a little bit. So once you cross underneath the Cascade Lakes Highway, you have to fill out your wilderness permit. This is the Three Sisters Wilderness. Well, the trail has been interesting so far. A lot of lava on either side. Here we are at our first junction, trail junction. Uh, the Pacific Crest Trail and Sisters Mirror Lake are to the right. And the Wikiup Plains Trail is to the right. And straight ahead, if we kept going, it would be towards Elk Lake. Still a little snow up here. We're not really that high, I don't think. There are a few flowers. This area, especially up near Broken Top, can really be beautiful flowers this time of year. Here's some purple ones. That looks like a lupine. Here comes another junction. I think this should be wiki up to the left. Two PCT to the left. Two PC to the north, this way. Marine Lake. We want to go that way. Here's a nice view of the butte that we're circumnavigating. I believe it's Kaliton Butte, although I'm not exactly sure the pronunciation. Uh, the trail's thinning out a little bit, or I should say the woods are thinning out a little bit. A little breeze is coming through, feels pretty good. There's a view of South Sister. And the plains open up here. Here's our next junction, a couple of signs here. I'm thinking we're supposed to go to the right here, although it doesn't really tell you. There's an old road, it looks like, that stays to the left. Don't know where it goes. Still a little snow here and there. Almost July. And there wasn't much snow in this area last year either historically low amount kind of a nice woods here it's open I think a lot of these are mountain hemlock trees Well, here we bust out into another view of South Sister. If you'd like to see that video of the climb, it's on my channel. It's pretty fun. It's about a 5,000 foot elevation gain from the trailhead that we started at. Not up this trail, but up a different trail. There's the big lava flow that comes off the South Sister. Looks like the mountain is getting a little bit socked in. It's kind of neat in this area where there are all these open plains.
Well, I gotta say, the snow is nice and cool. Still a bit of snow over there on the butte. We should be just about over to the climber's trail. Oh, there's a beautiful view of Broken Top. I think that's my favorite mountain out here. Pretty tough to beat this view. There's South Sister. There's Broken Top. And there's Mount Bachelor. All part of the Cascades, uh, they're volcanoes. Um, all of them have glaciers on them where they are, there are permanent uh, patches of snow, especially uh, Broken Top and South Sister. Well, here's lunch with a view. Beautiful Broken Top. We're sitting in the rocks here. And then we have South Sister up that way. A little bit obscured by the trees, but not too bad. Down this way is a lake called Moraine Lake. Very scenic down there. I don't think it's more than a mile over that way. Follow the trail that you can see there. So here is the junction of the Climber's Trail. We're heading down the Climber's Trail still. Plenty of snow in the little creek bed below, uh, beside us. It's all downhill from here. Look at the beautiful snow melt. All the moss. Really likes it. Not pretty. I just sit and look at that all day. Well, we're getting pretty close to the road now once she flattens out like this. The stream is still pretty. A few butterflies out in the little flowers here. Here we are back to the permit station, although this is not the one we came in on. This is the climber's trail, well, just a little ways over from where we came up. We'll go back the other way and look at the uh, main parking area. This is looking back at the uh, South Sister Climber Trail, the one we just came off of. We're headed this way across Cascade Lakes Highway. We are crossing the highway. A few people park out here. Oh, I don't know why. It's not much shorter to park in the parking lot. There's a creek again. Big old beam for a bridge here. That one's not going to break for a while. So this is where the climber's trail takes off between the outhouse and this little temporary um, office on wheels.
and this is the main parking lot we're up in the upper one today this one usually gets pretty busy today's no exception i don't see any open spots that's a trail over there and this side looks pretty full So this should get us back to our little trailhead. I should say our little parking area. We are back to where we started three and a half hours ago. It was 6.3 miles round trip. We took the loop. It was 1,330 feet of elevation gain. And I would say the trail is you know, easy to moderate. And you got great views. There's the last view of South Sister up there in the background. And we are parked in the RV and horse parking lot. You can park in either one, the lower lots. This is much less busy as you can tell. We're the only ones up here. And the other one was completely full. So. And if you're going to do this loop, you have to take off this way anyway. So so I hope you enjoyed the video. Julie and I always appreciate you watching. And as always, happy hiking.